In this example IRS notice, you're being asked for more details about your quarterly federal excise tax return, specifically Form 720. It appears that while you reported $200 in total taxes, you didn't provide a breakdown of the types of excise taxes like coal, gas, or oil, and the amounts for each. The IRS needs this information to process your return correctly. To resolve this, you need to fill out and return the enclosed Form 15105 within 30 days from the date of this notice. Make sure to review your Form 720 and list the tax for each type of excise tax you're reporting. Complete Part 3 of the form thoroughly. If the IRS doesn't receive this information within the specified time, your account may incur additional penalties and interest. If you need to contact the IRS for assistance, I highly recommend you watch to the end for the fastest method to reach a live person on the phone at the IRS. You have two methods to speak with a live person at IRS order forms and publications, a shortcut trick, and then the better method to get someone on the phone. So be sure to keep watching for the best method. Dial 1154. Now the next method is the better way to reach a live person at IRS order forms and publications. I built a calling tool. To use it, open up your browser, go to claimer.com, and search for the IRS order forms and publications option. Claimer can automatically call any phone line for you. It'll connect you directly to a human at IRS order forms and publications. It dials the number and stays on hold for you while it waits for an agent to take the call. When it detects an agent, it'll send the call to your phone. And here is Claimer sending me a call back from IRS order forms and publications with an actual agent on the line. It is a paid version, but it definitely works. You can see a lot of reviews of it with a quick Google search. Let me know in the comments how it worked for you.